السلام علیکم ورحمۃ اللہ وبرکاتہ ویلکم ٹو حسیب الیکٹرانکس فرینڈس آئی ہیو دس کیپیسٹر وی ہیو ٹو چیک اٹ ہاؤ یو کین ٹیسٹ اے نان پولر کیپیسٹر یوزنگ ملٹی میٹر سیٹ ملٹی میٹر ٹو کیپیسٹنس رینج ناؤ اٹ از ان اوہم رینج فار یوزنگ کیپیسٹر فنکشن وی ہیو ٹو پریس دا یلو بٹن اوکے اٹس ناؤ ان کیپیسٹنس رینج Before testing multimeter, always for testing a capacitor, never touch the poles to the capacitor. Sometime it is fully charged, maybe it is 220 volt charged or it has some voltage. So just make short to discharge it. Never connect multimeter capacitor until you discharge it or never touch your hand body to the terminals of the capacitor capacitance range when you want to make testing never touch the test leads or the test points it is 5.21 It is 5.212021 and it is 5 microfarad. So this capacitor is good. So if you don't have multimeter, what you will do? For testing without multimeter, or if your multimeter have does not have the capacitance function, what we can do? We will install two wires to the capacitor. Now we have two wires connected and I have this series lamp and we will connect to series lamp. The lamp should glow full. it's now glowing so this means it is passing the electrical current now remove the wires and don't touch the wires just only just only check again now the lamp is glowing i will remove the wires this test it is just to verify the function of the capacitor now we will measure the voltage this is ac capacitor polar capacitor now it is charged i will remove the wires set multimeter to dc volt and connect to the terminals we can see it have 116 115 volt so it is charged still i removed it and it have voltage so this is the reason always we have to make short other than if we try to test multimeter with multimeter at uh, capacitance it will damage the multimeter or uh, if i will touch without discharging it will make a short circuit it will make a shock to my both fingers so never touch touch it set multimeter to ohms and connect in this way we can see the resistance is increasing and it will go to open circuit because this time the capacitor is charging 18 mega that's nice because this time this capacitor is charging now reverse the polarity we can see the resistance in negative because there are some voltage on the capacitor so now 
when you connect multimeter in ohms ohms scale this will charge the capacitor from minimum to maximum resistance now the resistance is increasing in mega ohm so that means the capacitor is healthy if your capacitor multimeter does not have the capacitor function or you don't have the lcr meter capacitance meter that time you can test in these ways 5.2 microfarad so this is good because it is uh, plus minus 5 percent this is a very good capacitor so plus minus 5 percent 5.25 or 4.75 that is acceptable thanks for watching assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh